There are many applications you need on your PC, regardless of if you are very knowledgeable of Windows or not. These applications can make using your PC way easier if used correctly. They can give you better control of your FPS, boost your FPS, transform your VR games, and many more. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a handful of them. So let's start. The first application is RTSS or Riva Tuner Statistics Server. If you ask any computer enthusiast about the best way to monitor your FPS or lock your FPS, they will say RTSS. RTSS is an application that allows you to monitor your FPS and other information using a on-screen display. You can also customize the on-screen display using the overlay editor. To lock your FPS, simply set the frame rate limit value to whatever number you want. RTSS is better at locking your FPS because it truly keeps your FPS at a given number instead of giving a little leeway like in-game lockers. For instance, I set Doom the Dark Ages to a locked 60 FPS because the game simply looks a lot more stuttery without it. The next application is Lossless Scaling. This application seems like it was sent from the gods. Lossless Scaling is an application that recently gained fame because of how it allows you to double, triple, or even quadruple your FPS smoothly. Now of course you can multiply higher than 4, but anything over 4 gets bad. Now this application is also straightforward. Simply set your frame generation type to LSFG 3.0 and mode to fixed, then the multiplier between 2 and 4. Click scale and simply tab into your game and your frames will be multiplied. Now that's not it. This application also has upscaling. In my opinion it's not very needed though since every game released nowadays has FSR 3.0 or XESS, but nonetheless you can use this application's upscaling, but it's simply not better than in-game. Next application is UEVR. I just recently made a video regarding this and it is truly amazing if you set it up correctly. This application allows you to turn any Unreal Engine 4 or 5 game into a working VR game. It is kind of wonky, but for a free application, it works really well. Simply open your Unreal Engine 4 or 5 game, open UEVR, then click inject, and it will turn your game into a working VR game. To make this even better, there are community-made profiles for plenty of these games that make your experience even better. For a full in-depth tutorial, check out my previous UEVR video. Next application is CPU-Z and GPU-Z. For my computer geeks, these applications are very helpful. I use this all the time in my videos, whether it's on an old laptop or a high-end PC. GPU-Z shows your GPU specs and CPU-Z shows pretty much everything else. Your CPU, motherboard, RAM, etc. There is not much else to these two applications. They simply show you very useful information about your PC components. Simply download the setup or portable version and voila. Last but not least, we have Reshade. This is an application that is also really cool. This application works on many games and can turn your games from an ugly mess into realistic depending on how you set it up. Most games support hundreds of effects built into Reshade that can increase bloom, adjust contrast, add certain realistic filters, and plenty more. Simply install the application, set it up with your specific game, and follow the instructions to open the menu up while you're in the game. This app is pretty much what you make it. It makes your games beautiful if you use the correct effects. Thanks for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. And every application I recommended in this video also has a separate video going more in depth. But that's all. I will see you guys in the next one.